Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What is the eligibility requirements for food stamps in Utah? To be eligible for food stamps in Utah, you must meet specific income and resource requirements. Here are the key points to consider. Income requirements. Your household's gross monthly income must be at or below 130% of the federal poverty line. For example, for a household of three, the gross monthly income limit is $2,694. Net income. After deductions, your household's net income must be at or below the poverty line. For a household of three, this is $2,072 per month. Resource limits. Households without a member aged 60 or older or with a disability must have assets of $2,750 or less. For households with such a member, the limit is $4,250. Household composition. A household for food stamp purposes includes individuals who live together and purchase and prepare meals together. This can include spouses and most children under 22, even if they prepare meals separately. Work requirements. If you are between 19 and 60 years old, you must register for work, look for work, and have an approved employment plan with the Department of Workforce Services, DWS, unless you meet specific exemptions such as being physically or mentally unfit to work. Application process. You must apply for food stamps through the Utah Department of Workforce Services, DWS. You can apply online, visit your local DWS office, or apply at your Social Security office if you are also applying for SSI. Expedited benefits. If your household has very low income and resources, you may be eligible for expedited food stamps within seven days of applying. This includes households with less than $150 in monthly gross income and less than $100 in cash on hand. Special considerations. For individuals 60 years or older and SSI recipients, there are special privileges, such as the ability to withdraw cash from their food stamp account using an ATM or getting cash back at a grocery store without a fee. Verification process. After submitting your application, you will need to complete an eligibility interview and provide verification of the information you provided. This process typically takes 30 days, but expedited benefits can be issued sooner if you meet the criteria. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.